Hey man, I just started CrossFit and I got all the open workouts done as prescribed so far, but 20.5 has ring muscle ups and I can't do a single ring muscle up, man. You mean you don't know the secret tip on how to do 20.5 RX without doing ring muscle ups? Huh? What secret tip? Well, that's what we're going to be covering in this video. Hey, my name is Michael Groff and I'm going to be giving you a tip on how you can complete 20.5 completely RX without doing a single muscle up. Now obviously if you've been doing CrossFit for quite a while you're going to know this tip or what I call the secret tip. But for you who are watching who are brand new to CrossFit and you're brand new to everything CrossFit related then this video is for you. Also if this video helps you in any way consider joining the team by subscribing and hitting that notification bell. The goal of my channel is to help you as a new CrossFitter increase your athletic performance. And I do that by uploading a brand new video each week with practical training tips like this one as well as I review cross related products and training programs. But hey enough of me plugging my channel let's get into the secret tip. So if you're new to CrossFit you might have missed a very important piece of information when 20.5 was released. The stage is set the athletes are here. Darina let's hear what the workout is. So. 20 by 5 is for time. We've got 40 ring muscle ups. We've got 80 calorie row. And we've 120 wall ball shots. Hold on a second. Partitioned any way you like. So, guys, let the games begin. Did you catch it? If not, here it is 20.5 consists of 40 ring muscle ups, 80 calories in cardio and 120 wall balls. And you may be thinking, oh man, there goes any thought of me doing that workout RX. But I got news for you, you can do 20.5 RX even if you have never done any ring muscle ups and here is how. At the end of the 20.5 announcement, you'll notice that she said you can partition this workout any way you like. Hold on a second. Partition any way you like. Now this basically means you can structure your workout in any way that you want. So here's an example. If you cannot do any ring muscle ups, which you probably can if you clicked on this video, just put the ring muscle ups at the end of the workout and focus on completing the cardio and the wall balls first. After that, you have two options. You can then attempt your first ring muscle up or you can just call the workout quits. Either way, you've officially completed 20.5 as prescribed, but there are a few things to consider. If you have been doing the open scaled up to this point, then you might want to scale 20.5 as well just because you'll get a better workout because you'll be doing more work but for those of you who are able to complete all the open workouts as prescribed so far and you wanted to complete 20.5 as prescribed but you are going to be held up by the muscle ups this will help you a ton now if you wanted to get the best score possible in 20.5 here are your next steps first I compiled a playlist where I include some of the best tips and strategies for 20.5 that include tips from games athletes as well as coaches such as Cole Sager, Jacob Hebner, Brute Strength. So be sure to check out that playlist. It should be on the screen right now. Also, I'll link to it in the description below. The second thing you can do is if you have found value through this video, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe. But wait, don't click out of this video yet. If you do choose to subscribe, be sure to drop a comment down below telling me you subscribe because I'd love to personally welcome you to the team. But anyway, thanks for watching this video. See ya. Uh, you can click out of the video now.